always looks abandoned, huh? Looks like a piece of shit. Bell. Mr. Bell. What are you doing on my property? Mr. Bell, I'm Detective Wynn. This is Detective Johnson, all right? We're responding on that call you made about the dead body on your property. Remember that? Bodies round back. That's what you even call it. Either way. Mind putting down the gun, please? Real safe. Can you tell me anything about last night? Body? Hear anything? See anything? What are you trying to infer, detective? Nothing, just trying to get a better picture of the situation, that's all. Well, I'm a deep sleeper. I was sleeping last night, I didn't hear anything. Oh. Oh, Alright, Mr. Bell, why don't you do me a favor? You go back to your chair, be right with you after we look around a little bit. Nasty son of a bitch. Yup. Oh, man. Any chance of ID in this body? <laughs> uh, build suggests male. That's about the most we could do. Uh, no wallet. No nothing. You don't think Ronald has anything to do with that, no, do you? No, no. He's. I just think this is yeah. fucked up, that's what it is. Yeah. You wanna take over? Not really. Uh, uh, okay. A little trail. Trail? What the hell are you, Pocahontas now? <laughs> Maybe. Follow your trail, boy. I'll shout if I find something. Alright. Be right back.
John, is that you? John? Thomas Johnson. How do you know my name? Once one touches the crown, I learn everything about that person. Where am I? This realm has no name, but I can tell you why you're here. Your soul is being judged. My soul? Am I dead? Not yet. But in the coming minutes, one of two things will happen. One, you will either die a horrible, painful death. Is that what happened to the body we found? Precisely. Marcus, like yourself, touched the crown, but he was deemed unworthy. And what's the other option? The other option is that you're found worthy and in turn become the ruler of this new world. So who are you? You may call me the High Priest. I've been the advisor to every king since the beginning. How many kings have there been? Countless. But all temporary rulers. Why? Because there's only one true king, but he's yet to be found. What will happen when this one true king is found? And why is the judgment taking so long? You should take the length of the judgment as a good sign, Thomas. Marcus's judgment was over within seconds before proper introductions could even be made between him and I. But if the one true king is to be found, then this realm will consume Earth. What about the people on Earth? We'll be given a choice. On one hand, they can join the king and live out their days as his slaves. And on the other, they can die. That doesn't seem like much of a choice. And what's to stop them from rebelling against you? Fear. And if fear is not enough, then we'll slaughter as many as it takes for them to stop. There are plenty of disciples waiting on earth, waiting for the true king to arrive. This, this isn't real, this is, I must have hit my head or something. There's no escaping this place until judgment has been passed, Thomas. not real. This is not real, okay? I don't know. I don't know what I don't know what's happening, okay? You are not real. Tell yourself what you need to, but this is all very real. Thomas. You can fucking hear me shout your name? Found some shit over there you're going to want to see on a rock. Tom. 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 Oh, Thomas, wake up! Thomas! Tom. Mr. Bell. Put the gun down, okay? Just calm down. Just put the gun down. The king has arrived. Yeah,
job. John. John. My king, I've been waiting for you. I wouldn't believe it. Oh my god. If I hadn't seen it myself, Thomas. But the crown has chosen you. As the one true king. That's not true. That is not true.